EA Sports. It's in the game. For that rookie player, less experienced, who's just picking up the game, is using game flow to learn the game and the coaching tips, this notion of being able to be successful by just using the sticks and not having to remember, oh, X is Y and it does this and this is how I spin, and it reduces that button dependency and that yeah. kind of barrier to entry. But for that more experienced player with the locomotion, being able to just break people's ankles with the, the juke left, the juke right, and, and how responsive and fluid it is with the, with the branching animation, I mean, to me, that's gonna pay dividends for both, both sides of the house. Yeah, it definitely feels more at the moment where you think I'm gonna juke versus trying to time some kind of pre-canned animation. Mm -hmm. um, so it does feel more like you are empowered to be, you know, uh, a Chris Johnson making a juke in the backfield and then taking off. Um, because it's instant. The, the kind of third part of that equation is this you know, notion of like real assignment AI. And you know, plainly, the way I explain it is your guys do what they're supposed to do, especially when you're talking about the, the offensive and defensive line. I mean, do you think, that, you think that's something that the core guys are gonna pick up like immediately? Yeah, yeah, without a doubt. I mean, a running play, I, I can't even count. A sweet play in Madden for the last 10 years has been a crapshoot, you know? And so to now actually have your pulling guards get out there and yep. hit guys. And, and know ahead of time, you know, you can pull up your play art and see who they're going to go get. Uh, it's so rewarding. It's yeah. such a great feeling finally to have that where sometimes they'll get them before, sometimes they wouldn't. There's nothing more frustrating than having a blocker out in front, one defender, yep. and, he right yep. Yep. and he runs right by him. He runs right by him. Well, you get the jazz hands, right? When they're just like <laughs> like this. Jazz hands. <laughs> so to have that fixed, I mean, I, core, or if you've been playing for 20 years, or if it's your first year, that, it's a huge improvement. And even the double teams, right? Yeah, to absolutely. Get through. I mean, that just that that logic of knowing what their assignment is, yep. I think, is, is a game changer. Yeah. Obviously, scoring touchdowns. There's a lot of big moments in Madden, but one of the moments that we haven't been able to replicate very well in the last couple of seasons is is literally just being able to follow a blocker. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's actually quite rewarding when you you have a guy running ahead of you, he makes a block, you bounce to the outside, you right. go inside based well, on the you direction. See it. Yeah, it's, you're it's, not slamming down turbo. It, you right feel away, like you're, you're really waiting. executing a, yeah. a you know a football game at that point. I mean, it's it's a nice feeling. And you need to have patience sometimes. Yeah, you know, just run full speed all the time. That's when the sprint yeah, comes back into play. Right, that's when you, right. But it, it feels like the trenches are a lot more ratings driven now. When, when you've got a defensive end that's that's much more skilled, chances are he can get through that block, but at least your offensive lineman is attempting to, to keep him at from the At least he can get himself in the position to make the play before yeah. our guys just, they change their minds too frequently. Like, I'm gonna block you. No, now I'm gonna block you. No, yeah. now I'm gonna block you. And in that whole process, they just get slowed down. And yeah. Now they know they have their assignment. That's what they stick with. That's yep. what they do. And it makes everything work. Yeah, I mean, it's another core fundamental change. I mean. Yeah. Our focus is really fundamental gameplay all, all the time. Yeah. So, you know, we've made a lot of changes with game flow to make the game easier to pick up and play. Also, more authentic for you know a, a hardcore fan. But gameplay is all it's all about. I mean, if gameplay is not there, then it doesn't matter what else you do. It doesn't matter what your presentation is. It doesn't matter what your franchise mode is. If your gameplay is not there, and so um, having core blocking and locomotion like major rewrites in those areas, it's like I can't think of any better way to spend our our resources and time. Yeah. Madden NFL 11, August 10th, in stores everywhere. It's a wrap.